Welcome to our ongoing series about how a windmill pumps water. I'm sure you've watched our other videos and understand the basics now, but let's talk about an important part of how a windmill pumps water uphill. The important thing here today we're going to talk about is stuffing box. A stuffing box provides a sanitary seal and allows you to pressurize the pipe to push water up the hill, all the way up a steep mountain if necessary. The stuffing box is a brass and stainless steel device installed at the top of the drop pipe. It provides a seal so water won't shoot out and keeps contaminants from falling down into the water pipe. Let's take a closer look at a typical installation. Here you can see the stuffing box at the top of the drop pipe and always above the point of discharge where the water comes out the pipe. The stuffing box is a brass and stainless steel assembly with a stainless steel rod that'll have either 7 16 or 5 8 bolt threads, a brass nut, a brass packing gland, and then the body. The body on the bottom size has either inch and a quarter or two inch standard pipe threads. Inside, there's a packing material that seals it up tight. As you tighten the nut, it pushes down on the packing gland and seals it up tighter and tighter. I can't emphasize enough, do not over tighten this nut. It's okay if a little water drips out every now and again. Again, don't over tighten this nut. Now you probably say to yourself, I don't want water shooting out of there, I'll drain my tank. A correct insulation always has a check valve installed on the discharge side of the pipe right at the wellhead. This should be a brass full flow check valve that it wants water to go out every stroke, but doesn't let water go backwards into the system. That way it always pressurizes and pushes water out, but water cannot return. So now you understand the basics of a windmill stuffing box and how to pump water uphill. Remember, the stuffing box provides both a sanitary wheel seal and allows you to pressurize the drop pipe. I know it's tempting, but don't over tighten that packing nut. You'll regret it. Hey, check us out again at texaswindmill.com for more how-to windmill videos. Mm -hmm.